start here uh. sir taking up the other matters on which the president's address is being criticized one criticism has been on the point that the crises have not been contained that even though we have stated that the inflationary tendencies have been arrested yet there is no ostensible evidence of these prices coming down in the market it is again an unfortunate state of affairs we know that prices are controlled in two ways one as by the general laws of economics of demand and supply and the other is by legislation like we did through the defense of india rules para now so far as the first aspect is concerned the prices are controlled by seeing to it that supply is equal to demand at least that it they do not exceed the demand they should at least be able to meet the demand and that when that happens prices themselves stabilize and adjust themselves therefore it is absolutely necessary that there should be sufficient production in the country both in the in industrial as well as in the agricultural sector but what has been the attitude of the opposition on this particular aspect whereas it is absolutely necessary that there should be 100% man days working in industry and agriculture right through the year we have seen that the total strategy of the opposition has been to promote bharat band to promote strikes to raise all kinds of industrial disputes to cause unrest among the agricultural labor and thus by all means to ensure that the production is crippled it requires an ostrich to ignore a contradiction of this type when you are crippling production then the prices cannot come down para the other method of controlling prices is by the various legislation it is a method still open to the government and maybe if otherwise the prices cannot be contained the other method may be used on some unforeseeable occasion but speaking for myself i would still be adho advocating the contain the prices by the normal economic laws socialism always means an increase in production an increase in the wealth of the country by producing more in industry and agriculture and it is result of this increased production which is distributed amongst the people that is the concept of socialism i would expect that when we ask for cooperation from the opposition we are asking for cooperation of this kind stop